Morning, Brian. Good morning, Kier. I have a question for you, sir. Shoot. Uh, what in the world is a virtual run? A virtual run, sometimes it's called a virtual race, mm -hmm. is one that you do where you live. Okay. You don't have to go anywhere downtown with 10,000 sweaty strangers on a Saturday morning and, and run a prescribed course. Okay. You do it from your house, your treadmill, your park, your trail, uh, wherever and however you want to do it. Mm. So we call it a virtual run, but you could put an asterisk on the run okay. uh, because you, it's any forward movement. You can walk, you can run, you can skip, bike, or sashay. Uh, if you wish to meander or trudge, uh, you can do that. Any forward, any forward yeah. motion. Just don't, you know, don't do it in a car. Don't you know, <laughs> you know, you know that 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 doesn't work. But um, you can do it however and whenever you want. Okay. So, unlike having to go downtown on a Saturday morning or a prescribed day, um, you can do it Thursday afternoon, or you can do it Monday night or, or Tuesday morning. And if the distance is too long, you're like, yeah, I've never done a five k before mm. in one shot. Do one k a day for five days. Oh, okay. All right. So it's it's however, wherever, and whenever you want to do it. Your race, your pace, your place. Okay. You say race. So is there any competitive aspect to it, or my? You're am I only competing against yourself. Okay. And and trying to do better than you did yesterday or or last month. Um, we don't have people submit times. Uh, it's all on the honor system. Okay. So as long as you're registered for the event, uh, you're going to get your medal. Okay. And uh, completing the distance is up to you, but we don't do first, second, third. This is this is not a competition. Um, but the words run, race, those are uh, ubiquitous terms that are frequently thrown around, and we just kind of want to dispel those myths cool. that you don't actually have to run, and it's there's no time compared to somebody else. Gotcha. Okay, great. So it's really it's really open ended. It, it's up to the discretion of the person who registers. It is, and because our whole motivation is. We just want to inspire people, communities of fans, to be more physically active. Uh, geeks are notoriously sedentary. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> let's be honest. I mean, we, we spend a lot of time uh, in front of computer screens or binge watching TV shows on the couch uh, or reading books, uh, mm -hmm. yeah, a few. Uh, we don't do a whole lot of time on the treadmill or outside with the big glowy disc in the sky. Uh, yeah, we, well, well, our fandoms tend to work against that, right? It's giving, <laughs> it's giving us things to watch and play and listen to and read and whatever. So, so you're using fandom to flip it in the other direction. To flip it in the other direction. And cool. try, trying to get geeks, nerds, dorks, dweebs, uh, people who are just passionate yeah. about stuff, uh, trying to harness that power uh, to get them out and get them moving. Gotcha. Cool.